everybody, listen up. It's gonna be a bit of a ride to the reserve, so let's try and keep things civilized, okay? This sucks. <laughs> it's really important that we learn about different cultures here in Canada, especially the indigenous ones. I learned enough on Main Street. <laughs> wow, that was rude. It was just a joke, line up. Okay, just to remind everybody, uh, those who are carving, you're with Mr. Downey. Uh, the ones who are beating, you're coming with me. And those going to the sweat, you're with Mrs. Carson. So let's have a great day, guys. And really, remember, respect. Well, have fun beating, Emily. What, you're not coming with me? No, didn't I tell you? I'm going to the sweat. Anna, are you serious? <laughs> yeah, why? What's wrong with that? It's gross. If I wanted to sweat, I'd go to sauna. Whatever. Me glitch. And now we'll be saying a prayer. We give you thanks, Creator, for Mother Earth that we walk on and the air that we breathe. We give thanks, Creator, for the food that you provide for us. We thank you for this day, Creator, and ask that you guide us in our journey for a healthy lifestyle. Miigwech, Amen. Hello. Hello. Um, I was wondering if I could come to another sweat. Sure, we have a youth sweat every Saturday. There's one tomorrow. Okay. I was asking because I saw a woman in there. Do you know what it means? Mm, time will tell what it means. <laughs> my necklace. Anna. Hmm? What? What do you think? Oh, that's pretty. Thanks. So, that was the field trip. That's better than I thought it'd be, actually. What did you do? Oh, I made this. Oh, that's nice. You should see Tracy's. It's really nice. How about you, Anna? What did you do? Who are my parents? What? I mean, I know I'm part native, but that's it. What else do you know? Well, not much. We know you're Ojibwe and uh... That's about all we were told, actually. So where's this coming from?
Well, you know who your parents are. So you're adopted? Since when did that bother you? It doesn't. I'm just wondering. So what? Our family's not good enough for you? Emily. Anna. I'm not hungry. Sit down, please. You know, if you want, we can call Child and Family Services on Monday. They probably have some information. You think? Well, they might. Okay, let's try that. Are you coming back to the table? I'm really not hungry, Mom. Okay, I'll heat it up later if you want. Thanks. Water? Thanks. You came back? Yeah. I thought you might. How come? I saw you talking to my uncle yesterday. Oh, right. My name's Leah. I'm Anna. Hi. You staying for a bit? Um, yeah, sure. Hey, let's get changed. I want to show you something really cool. Okay. got that right. What do you mean? It's a sacred site. These are called petroforms. They were created centuries ago for teaching and healing. Nice. Yeah. A turtle. What's the turtle for? The turtle plays a big part in the creation story. How so? Well, in 25 words or less, when the planet was just water, turtles swam down to the bottom of the waters and surfaced with mud, which the creator used to make the land. How come you know all of this? I know everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. My grandma's been teaching me this stuff since I was a kid. Nice. That's awesome. Actually, sometimes it's pretty boring. Who can turtle teach me? Lots. Creation happens in everything. There's a new discovery in every new beginning.
Can I tell you something? Yeah, of course. Something happened to me yesterday in the sweat. Um, I saw something weird. Really? What? I don't know. A woman? Did you see her today? No. Hmm. What do you think it means? I'm not sure. Could be a blood vision. What's a blood vision? A memory of an ancestor. Wow. That's weird. Speaking of weird... What's this one? This is my favorite. What's it look like to you? Uh, it looks like a person. It is. This man asked Wanabu Zoo, who is both good and evil, human and spirit, for eternal life. So, Wanabu Zoo turned him into rock. Wow, be careful what you wish for, right? Exactly. What's this one? I don't know. <laughs> I thought you knew everything. Haha, <laughs> very funny. What's that? What? Hey, wait up. These are for my mom. Nice. Are we gonna visit her? Well, sort of. Sort of. Where are we going now? To my cucumbers. Who's that? My grandma. I live with her. Oh. Where are you going? I'm going to show you how to get your auto get your organ. Oh, right. Thanks for the supper, it was really good. Oh, you're quite welcome. What was that about? A girl we knew took her life last month. Sorry to hear about that. Thanks. Actually, it's been happening a lot in recent years. Sometimes you just get numb to it. Why does that happen? Isolation. Hopelessness. Anyway, kugum has gone to visit the parents. They're taking it pretty hard. Guess sometimes being numb is not an option. What about you? How are you doing? Better. Hmm. Anyways, want some tea? Yeah, sure. I had a nice day today. Yeah, me too. Me watch? Oh, mm, very good. Is that you? Yes. That's hysterical. I'm glad you're amused. Is that you too? Yeah. That's cute. Yeah.
okay? Hmm? Oh, you know about the vision I told you about? Um, this is who I saw. My mother? This is my sister. That's... That's me. Why couldn't I stay? From what I've been told, Kukum fought to keep both of us after Mom's car accident. Sia Vest didn't think she could handle it, but she finally convinced him to let her keep one of us. But why you? Apparently, it would have been harder on me because I was older. Makes sense, I guess. Oh, thanks. Mom's always smiling. Yeah, she loved life so much. I don't even look like you. You look like your dad. My dad. Yeah, we have different dads. But that's a long story. Here, that's your dad. Oh, wow. I really do look like my dad. Is he around? No, he took off after mom died. Oh, do you know where he is? No. What about your dad? I see him once a year. He's up north somewhere. Right. I wonder what time it is. Oh crap, I really should get going. No way, man. You're staying over. It's too late. You think? Yes, I think. Yeah. Oh, okay. You're probably right anyway. I guess I should text my mom. Okay, let's see. Hey, mom. Staying over at Tracy's tonight. See you tomorrow. Love you. This is so weird. No kidding. You are in big trouble. Nice to see you too. Um, Emily, this is Leah. Mom, Anna's home. You knew I needed the car last night. Oh, sorry about that. Actually, I have something to tell you. Anna, in the kitchen, now. I'll be right back. Make yourself comfortable. <laughs> Give me the car keys. You lied to me. I talked to Tracy's mom and you were never there. I'm sorry. So where did you go? Can I say something? No. Did you forget about your sister? Your father had to drive her to work and then pick her up when she closed. I'm sorry, Dad. Uh, can I use your washer? Um, yeah. It's up the stairs and to your right. Okay. Where were you? I was at Leah's house. Who? Is that the girl with you? Yeah. Where does she live? She lives on a reserve. What? On the reserve? Anna, that could have been dangerous. Does the teepee have central air? <laughs> Hold on a second here. What's going on? The most amazing thing has happened. Leah is my sister. What? As if. That's ridiculous. It's true. I met her Friday on the field trip. And then when I went back yesterday, we figured it out. Figured what out? You're not listening. 
I went back to the sweat yesterday because I saw something. I felt something. Anyways, Leah showed me around the reserve in the afternoon, and then after supper, she showed me a photo. It was of her baby sister before she was adopted. Look. She had this? Yeah, it was in her grandmother's photo album. This is unbelievable. It's true, Mom. Come on, I want you to meet her. Where is she? All right, um, she went to use the bathroom. Oh, I'll go get it. She's not here. What did you do? Oh, Mom. I feel so bad. Help Anna find her sister. I'm, I'm sorry for the way I've been acting. Should be. It's like, I feel like, like I'm losing you as a sister. What? Really? Let's go find her, okay? Okay. Hi. Hi. I wish I knew her. I don't remember her at all. She knew you. She knows you, Anna. And you'll know her too in time. So me, Kukum? Maybe... Maybe she's watching over us right now. You know, my family's really nice. They're just upset over what I did. I know. I guess big sisters have to look out for their little sisters, eh? Yeah. Speaking of which, I want you to meet Emily. Again? Yes. <laughs> 